Hey guys, I'm Deepthi Desikin and as you guys saw by the title, I'm going to be talking about a super super popular product that went viral on TikTok and everywhere else. It was out of stock for the longest time. I tried to get my hands on it and then I couldn't and then I finally placed an order with an Instagram store which I will link down in the description box below and I also think this is going to be available on the Clinique India website very soon and I think Nika and everywhere as well. So the product I'm going to be talking about is the Clinique almost lipstick and this one is in the shade black honey oh my god it was so hard to get my hands on this and i was very very curious as to what this product was hyped up so much for so this is what the bullet of it looks like and this is what the shade looks like so it looks like a black like almost like cherry black shade and when you swatch it it is quite sheer so it's an almost lipstick so it's not like as pigmented as a lipstick but it's almost like a tinted lip balm and this is what the shade looks like when i swatch it on my arm so it's it's like dark in the bullet and this is how it turns out to be so ever since i got this particular product i have used this quite a bit and unknowingly i was actually reaching out for it a lot more so i have used this up quite a bit since i ever got it so uh, it takes a couple of layering up for me for my lips because I have like uneven lips and it's not the most like pink looking lips or anything of that sort so I do need a little bit more product to get it to an even looking um, way otherwise it looks a little patchy it looks weird and if you have dryness flakiness it does exaggerate it it does emphasize it and also because it's not very pigmented if you have like patchy lips like I do it looks weird so it goes on like a sheeny tinted lip balm like i mentioned during the start of this video and uh it's pretty moisturizing on my lips for about an hour or two and then after which it can dry your lips out like it happens to me with most lip balms with most tinted lip balms and this starts to dry down dry up my lips a little bit not very uh very very bad but it does like kind of get a little bit flaky especially if you have already dry lips it might dry your lips out furthermore okay so anyways because the shade looks like a cherry kind of like a dark cherry shade i picked up quite a few lipsticks that were similar to this just to find dupes for that to my disappointment because when you apply this it actually goes on a little bit like red toned okay and not so much like a plummy shade so i have quite a few um shade dupes uh, to talk to you guys about similar products to talk to you guys about and also some alternatives that are not similar in terms of shade at all but just in case you wanted to try out some other lip tinted lip balms i have a couple of categories of everything i will let you guys know throughout the video like the closest match but i'm just trying my best here you guys the first one that i saw a lot of people like recommend was this one this is a nivea berry shine um lip balm this is a tinted lip balm and this one in comparison to the black cherry from Clinique this goes on more like a berry toned shade so you can see this one has a little bit more red but this one is just straight up like a berry shade but it is a really nice tinted lip balm and again it's quite moisturizing on the lips for the first initial hours after which it can dry your lips out and this one does take a little bit of building up to do on your lips as well so in case you didn't want to spend around 2000 rupees on like a tinted lip balm you can try this for a fraction of the cost and uh, it goes on pretty much the same the pigmentation and everything is pretty much the sa same just that the shade shade is a little different because this one has more of like that plummy cherry undertones to it whereas this one has more of like a red brick red kind of an undertone to it so there is a little bit of a difference so this is not a hundred percent shade match but if you wanted something that is similar like a tinted lip balm you could try this out okay and then i sat and like got a couple of other ones that i felt could be similar now this one is from the sugar i think this is also the tinted lip balm and this one is in the shade number 04 lit so this actually compared to the black cherry is very similar like the shade is very very similar let me swatch it for you guys so can you see that the shade is almost like identical 
but this one is a little bit more sheer compared to the Clinique Black Honey lipstick itself. So that is already like a tinted lip balm and this one is a little bit more sheer than that itself. So it does take quite a bit of building up to do. I had to go about it about like six to seven times on my lips just to build it up to get it to that. And you guys can see from the swatch, the shade is similar, but this one is a little bit more sheer. But if you wanted like a very, very similar shade, like an un like. 100% accurate shade uh, to the black honey lipstick you can try this out but just keep in mind that it is a little bit sheer and you will tend to run out of this product a little bit faster because uh, if you have pigmented lips again you have to build on it a lot and it might not even work out for you like the way you want it to okay so I also got another shade from the sugar tinted lip balm this one is in the shade bramble and this is the shade number 07 it looks like the clinique black honey lipstick itself in the tube but again this one is more of a cherry tone shade which is very similar to the nivea um, lip balm okay so again you can try out most tinted lip balms if you want to and if you're very very particular about the shade you can try out the shade lit but if you're not very particular about the shade then anything would work for you and i'm going to be talking to you guys about a couple of other shades that are very similar to that as well so so this is the closest that i could get in terms of tinted lip balms so then let's move on to a lip tint that i found from cuffs and lashes this one is their let's go tinting lip tint and this one is in the shade pepper pots i tried out a couple of uh, lip tints that i own and all of them were like completely different shades and this was the only one that had that uh, cherry reddish burnt undertone to it and so i decided to include this one so this is what the cuffs and lashes lip tint looks like and you can also see how it looks like on the lips it is ha having a little bit more berry tones to it compared to this one but when you apply it with a very light hand a sheer layer of it it looks quite similar to the black honey lipstick itself but of course the finish is a lot different so the cuffs and lashes lip tint is a little bit more matte it's not as sheeny looking it doesn't have like that balm kind of a finish like the black honey lipstick so if you wanted a quite like a similar shade you could probably try this out or if you already have it then you can apply this with a light hand on your lips instead of splurging that much of money so i'm also going to be giving you like similar shade options and everything because that's what my channel is all about i like to be like everything in one video it should be concise so that you don't go around looking for a lot of options okay and then um let's move on to the next a couple of options that i found this one is from essence and this one is in the shade this is their long lasting lipstick these are very sheeny looking on the lips and they're not very very pigmented so they work out to be quite similar to that itself and i have tried to apply it with a light hand i've tried to apply it with a very intense hand as well so uh this shade in now or never has a little bit of a brown uh, brownish red hints to it and if compared to uh, black honey they work out to be very similar of course i have applied it with a light hand first a sheer layer to show you guys how it looks and i've also applied it with a little bit of a heavier application to build it to the full pigmentation of the lipstick to show how it would work and you can see how they look like on the lip the thing with the clinique black honey lipstick is if i try to like layer it on it kind of takes away the lipstick underneath it but um if you see the shade they are quite similar uh, i really like how it looks and i feel like it is pretty good of a shade match and also the formula it's not very very pigmented the essence lipstick it's not very drying on the lips and it is quite long lasting as well i really like the formula of essence lipstick and also from essence i have the shade famous which is not an accurate shade match because famous has a little bit more of a purple hint to it like a berry purple hint to it uh, again not a 100% shade match but when you apply it with a light hand they do look quite similar the last uh, shade option that i have is from swiss beauty this one is their matte lipstick i think this is what it's called it's 400 rupees it's a really affordable formula but when i first bought this i was super disappointed with it because it doesn't really have the pigmentation of a lipstick and i was like trying to uh, look through my collection and i found this one uh, it doesn't really apply with a lot of pigmentation so it's quite similar to that it's just that it doesn't really have that much of a glossy sheeny finish to it and this one is in the shade natural cocoa again they swatch a lot deeper on the hand but you can see on the lips as well and uh, i don't really like the formula of this one to be honest i don't really like the smell of this as well these are really affordable but they do have that you know like 
waxy smell and like a little bit of perfume mixed to it so i'm not a very big fan of this formula in general but i'm just again stating out all the options that i have and then something uh, that is not similar in terms of shade nothing it's not even close to it but i just want to give you guys options of tinted lip balms available in the market the ones that i feel like are a little bit pigmented so the first one i have is the innisfree uh, simple lip color balm and this one is in the shade dahlia now this is an orange kind of like a shade i just imagine it would be like a cherry shade but this is like a straight up orange shade it is pretty pigmented and it has like a nice comfortable finish on the lips but it smells so bad like it smells like a dead rat i'm not sure what it is it's nauseating and i just almost wanted to throw up uh, so yeah i'm not sure if just mine is like this let me know if you guys have tried this one out but yeah the shade i mean like the shade the finish and everything looks nice and it's not very very sheer like the clinic lip balm where i have to apply it time and time again and build on it it's not like that but it's just stinks and then um i also have a tinted lip balm from mama uh, this one is their cherry tinted lip balm and i love the way this one looks it's a very subtle uh, wash of color like a subtle red color and it also has a nice smell to it and it's not very very drying on the lips but it's not too sheeny looking as well so this is a good option to try out if you guys want to in case you are like okay now i don't want to try out all of that i just want a good tinted lip balm option and if in case you wanted like similarish shades you could try out the ones that i recommended um yeah it is a little bit of a different product because the shade is maybe common but because the finish is so like sheer and sheeny looking it's a lot harder to find the dupes for it so i hope you guys enjoy this video and found it helpful uh, let me know what you think about this in the comment section down below and while you're at it give this video a big thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell so you're notified every time i upload a new video and i'll see you guys in my next one and I'm watching the rise And I wouldn't say I'm shocked cause I'm hardly surprised This one's for the ride This one's for who knew I'd make it, just needed some time This one's for my wife